We are with Duke coach Jamie Green. Jamie, uh, you climbed all the way to the top and won this thing. Great job. Thanks. Yeah, the guys played great. Uh, you know, it's in match play like this with a team format, you can never say somebody blew somebody out or not, but you, you sort of were in control all day and just held on all day long. Well, you know, I think from the start, these guys had great mindsets. You know, they were, they were determined and they were focused and um, they, they didn't want to just hold on. You know, they were, they were trying to win and win big. And, and obviously, if you've got a pretty fearless mindset, um, some good things can happen for you if you have a good game plan. Yeah, and hold on was probably the wrong word. What I was really alluding to is that you just stayed, you, you got out ahead, you stayed ahead, and you never really let them get a chance. You never opened the door back for them. Right. Well, that's, you know, we talked about that uh, a little bit, is you don't want to be playing holes to, to not lose. You know, you, you got to have the mindset of, of just dominating every time you step on the tee. And, you know, if you do, you do. You can't control the other guy, really. Uh, sometimes you have to alter your game plan a little bit midstream on a hole if, if it uh, requires it. But... Um, really, like I said, I think these guys, just from the day we got here, they took great notes in the practice round, they stuck to it, and they were really determined. Now, we talked yesterday about changing your game plan for today, and of course you said you weren't going to, but being that it was match play as opposed to stroke play, did you approach it differently from that perspective? Uh, yeah, I guess from the standpoint that uh, you really got to let the hole go when it's over with. I mean, sure, if you win a couple of holes in a row, you feel some momentum, you're feeling pretty good about yourself. but. Um, you just never know what the other guy's going to do. And uh, in that case, you know, the golf course, you're really just controlling yourself in stroke play. Uh, you're controlling the golf course and, you, and what you do. But in match play, there's that unknown. You don't know what the other guy's going to do and how well he's going to play. So they really, I think you've got to stop each hole when it's over with, start a new one, and, uh, you know, clear, calm mindset once again. Any concerns about transitioning back to stroke play now in that same regard? Need to talk about that or you just feel it'll come naturally? Uh, you know, I think the reality of it is how they played down the stretch in these matches where, uh, you know, they kind of kept the pedal down. They were, they were determined and focused. I think that's what you want to do in stroke play. Like I said, it's, it's a little bit of a different mindset where you can get some momentum going in stroke play to a degree. Um, you know, you don't want to necessarily stop each hole sometimes. You'd like to just keep going after a great round on 18. But, uh, yeah, it's still playing the golf course. Well, uh, great job, congratulations, and we'll see you down the road. Sounds good, thanks.